Gurdil Singh Rahi, Gurdil Sai, the 10th of January 1933 to the 16th of August 2016, was a Punjabi language writer, novelist, and migration agent from Punjab, India. He started his literary career in 1957 with a short story, Baganwale. He became known as a novelist when he published the novel Mari Da Diva in 1964. The novel was later adapted into the Punjabi film Mari Da Diva in 1989, directed by Surinder Singh. His novel Anhe Gore Da Don was also made into a film of the same name in 2011 by director Gurvinder Singh. Singh was honoured with the Padma Shri in 1998 and Jainanpith Award in 1999. <laughs> Life and work Early life Gurdil Singh was born on 10 January 1933 in the village of Baini Fateh near Jaitu in British Punjab. His father, Jagat Singh, was a carpenter, and his mother, Nihal Kaur, took care of the household. The young Singh began working as a carpenter at the age of 12 to support his family's poor financial conditions. By his own admission, Singh worked 16 hours a day when he took on various jobs such as making wheels for bullock carts and metal sheet forming for water tanks. Together, he and his father earned 20 rupees 28 US a day from hard labor. In childhood, Singh was interested in painting but gradually he applied himself to a formal education. After successfully persuading Singh's father that his son was worthy of more schooling, Maidan Mohan Sharma, the headmaster of a middle school that Singh attended in Jato, encouraged the young boy to stick with his studies, even though his father thought it was futile. Singh completed his matric examination while he worked in various daytime jobs. At the age of 14, he married Balwant Kaur. In 1962, he took the job of school teacher in Nanpur Kotra which paid him 60 rupees 83 US in monthly salary. Meanwhile, Singh continued his own education, went on to receive his BA in English and History, and followed that up with a MA in 1967. <laughs> <laughs> Literary career Singh started his literary career in 1957 with a short story, Baganwale, which was published in Panj Darya, a magazine edited by Mohan Singh. His later stories were published in Preetlari, edited by Gurbakh Singh. His major work, Mari Da Diva, established his reputation as a novelist. Singh wrote four different versions of the novel over the course of four years, before he decided to publish the fourth and final one in 1964. The various characters Singh portrayed in the novel were recreations of real-life people woven into a fictitious storyline. It was translated into English by Sahitya Akademi as The Last Flicker. Singh's other notable works included the novels Anho 1966, Addh Shanani Riyat 1972, Anhe Gore Da Don 1976 and Parsa 1991, collections of short stories including Sagi Phul 1962, Kutta Te Admi 1971, Bagana Pind 1985 and Karar D Dingri 1991 and autobiographies Neean Mat Indian, 1999, and Doji Dehi 2000, published in two parts. The novels Addh Shanani Riyat and Parsa have been translated into English as Night of the Half Moon, published by Macmillan, and Parsa by the National Book Trust, respectively. Singh's favorite works included Leo Tolstoy's Anna Karenina, Irving Stone's Lust for Life, John Steinbeck's The Grapes of Wrath, Fanishwar Nath Renu's Myla Ankle, Prem Chand's Gaudan, and Yashpal's Divya. Topic. Awards and honors Singh received various awards over the course of his life, including the Sahitya Akademi Award in Punjabi in 1975 for the novel Adh Shanani Riyat, the Soviet Land Nehru Award in 1986, the Bai Veer Singh Fiction Award in 1992, the Shiromani Sayatkar Award in 1992, the Jainanpith Award in 1999 and the Padma Shri in 1998. He shared the Jainanpith Award with Hindi language author Nirmal Verma. Topic: <laughs> Death. Singh suffered from a heart attack earlier in 2016 after which he was partially paralyzed. 
On 13 August 2016 he fell unconscious at his home in Jaitu and was admitted into a private hospital at Batinda where he was kept on ventilator support. He died on 16 August 2016, when he was taken off life support systems, after it was determined that Singh had shown no signs of recovery. He is survived by his wife, Balwant Kaur, a son and two daughters. Works Singh has published various novels, short story collections, plays, children's literature and also an autobiography in two parts. Sapno K. Se Din was one of his works, talking about his childhood days and is included in CBSE Class 10 Hindi Course B.